Hi everybody, this is Josh Wool running for the United States Senate in Massachusetts against Elizabeth Warren, and apparently Republican candidate Geoff Deal, D-I-E-H-L is his name. Uh, he's, as I said, he's the Republican candidate. Uh, Elizabeth Warren is going to be the Democratic candidate, and I am the Independent. And as we know, there's a corrupt two-party system, uh, and it is rigged. It's basically a soap opera. So we're going to watch the soap opera unfold as we, the American people, try to get me elected and put an end to this uh, real deal, as Mr. Deal likes to call himself. Uh, Mr. Deal's come out and uh, was checking out some of uh, his information on Mass.Live. And, well, he talks about how upset he is about Elizabeth Warren's book deal. Uh, really? It's her book deal? That's why you're going to run against her for U.S. Senate? Are you kidding? The woman allowed election fraud. She supported Hillary Clinton. Uh, she's supported the big banks, the TPP. I mean, the list goes on and on. But Mr. Deal says that he is not going to write a book during his first term as a U.S. Senator if he's elected. Uh, if I... Can't even take the guy seriously. I mean, he's got this look, you know, cookie cutter establishment candidate, and that's what he is. You know, uh, I guess he's in my area of uh, Kingston, somewhere down here. I saw a sign for him, and uh, you know, I guess game on, you know. But it's going to be up to you, the American people, to continue to inform people in Massachusetts to help uh, not just me, but independents and third party candidates around the country to try and put an end to this corrupt system uh, as long as you know well here's the goal okay we need a new Congress we need to take back our country from special money interests we need to stop the wars rather than continue to expand into Syria we need to expand renewable energy resources we need to rebuild our infrastructure America is falling behind. We're not We're not doing better. We're taking a step back. We're cutting out 22 million Americans in their health care. One, one in three Americans is going to be drinking uh, polluted drinking water. And this is what the real deal, uh, G-Off deal is talking about. We can't have book deals during your first six years in Congress. That's crazy, right? That's the crazy thing. Uh... The real deal is apparently a real joke, um, and he's got nothing. He's just cookie cutter. Uh, that's all I can see. He's a state rep right now, uh, clearly looking to move up. And in the way our corrupt system works is you got to take the hit at some point because not everybody gets to move up. So you're going to have to run against Warren, lose to her, so she can then try to be the next U.S. president against Trump. And then later on, he'll get rewarded for taking the hit. So, it's disgusting. It's sickening. Uh, it's 4th of July weekend. Uh, Mr. Geoff, you're a disgusting human being. Elizabeth Warren, oh God, I hope you choke on a flag. And it's time for the American people to be done. Done with this corruption, with this shenanigans uh, you want real people, you want to keep health care, you want a living wage, you want to see the American dream happen, then fight for me, Joshua Ford, for the United States Senate here in Massachusetts. Fight for good people across the country, independents, third party candidates, green party candidates. No more can we continue to support the Republican and Democratic soap opera. That's all it is. If you support it, you might as well just go t drink some radioactive water because that's what's coming. So go enjoy your 4th of July weekend. Have some fun. Watch some fireworks. And then Monday, come out swinging. It is time to make a difference in this country. We can no longer stand for this corruption. We can no longer stand for cookie-cutter candidates. We can no longer stand for the lies of Elizabeth Warren and controlled opposition candidates. So you're forced to vote for the lesser of two evils. If you don't remember what that feel like, remember Trump, remember Hillary. 
lesser of two evils. And that's what we're getting right here. This is what we're getting now. Thankfully, there's a third candidate. Me. Joshua Ford for the U.S. Senate in Massachusetts in 2018. Thank you for your time. Please share this video.